Izzy here, and today we're gonna take a look at an affordable ultra-wide zoom for your crop sensor camera. Stay tuned. All right, so let's take a look and see what Tamron includes in the box of the 10 to 24 DI2 VC HLD lens. It better be a lens. So the first thing we're gonna find is their warranty card. And here are some instructional pamphlets and more warranty information. Remember, this has a six-year manufacturer's warranty in the U.S. and if it's purchased from an authorized dealer like Digital Goja. Here we have the lens, but guess what? This is also very important. On this little side box right here is their new redesigned lens hood, which snaps right on. So that's really nice that they give you a proprietary lens hood. But let's take a look at the most important thing in here, I believe, is of course the new Tamron 10 to 24 crop sensor. Mm -hmm. Let's take a closer look at the features and specs of this beautiful lens. Now remember, this new Tamron is meant for your crop sensor camera. So if you have a crop sensor Canon like a Rebel or a 7D Mark II or an 80D or a 70D, all those will work perfectly on here. If you have a Nikon version, that means it'll work with your D7200s, your D500, your D3400s perfectly. Now, this is again a 10 to 24, 3545. So it is a variable aperture, but again, it does give you the fantastic image stabilization. Now, the aperture range is from 35 to f29, so you can stop down for incredible depth of field. It has one XLD element and one LD element with, of course, aspherical and hybrid aspherical elements, plus their famous BBAR and fluorine coatings. What does that mean? That means that the front element has been coated with fluorine so that it's moisture resistant to dust, dirt, and smearing. Now, it is an all metal construction, so this feels really good to the hand. I mean, we're back to that new line from Tamron where the lenses are incredibly well manufactured. You have the new HLD autofocus motor. This is newest technology in lens construction that gives you fantastic autofocus, quick, fast, and smooth, and quiet. So you videographers are gonna love this. And speaking about video, if you're going to need an ultra wide zoom, for your crop sensor camera, the video capabilities of these are incredible because it's up to four stops image stabilization. So that means you can handhold this in any environment, even if you're working in low light. Notice how on the side here, we have our autofocus and manual focus override button. But remember, you do have full-time manual focus on here. So when you turn this, you can do your tweaking for your focus and override it at any given point. And this is where you have your on off switch for your vibration compensation. And let's take a look at the back. Notice the weather sealing, which again is throughout the entire lens. This isn't just in the rear and front, it's all throughout. So whenever you do any kind of zooming or focusing or any kind of environment, this guy is gonna be completely able to work in any inclement condition. And of course, there is the new Re, totally redesigned lens hood, which completely reverses into itself. So that means it's great for easy storage and you can take it with you everywhere. It works with a standard 77 millimeter diameter thread size for your filter. So that means you can find some great UV, CPL, and of course, ND filters for us videographers on the market. So there we have it the new Tamron 10 to 24 3545 DI version 2 VC HLD lens. So I hope this unboxing and overview of the Tamron 10 to 24 DI2 VLC HLD. Yes, it is a mouthful, but as you notice, it's a fantastic lens. Hopefully it helped you out. If it did, as always, don't forget to hit me up with that like button underneath and subscribe to the channel for future unboxings, frequently asked questions, and tutorials. And don't forget, if you're in the Miami area, come by and say hello at the Digital Goja showrooms. Happy shooting.